Today was the sixth annual Arctic Innovation Competition at the UAF Wood Center Ballroom. This competition is designed to give inventors of all levels the opportunity to present their invention idea without any elaborate business plans or prototypes. The Arctic Innovation Competition is a very unique event. We have three divisions. I mean, a division for adults, a division for teens, and a division for children. After all the idea submissions were made in advance, the judges chose the most well-received ideas. And today, those selected inventors set up a science fair-like display and then gave a short five-minute pitch to the judges who came from diverse areas of business and engineering expertise. So our invention is a ground control station for drones. It's called Routinely. Uh, basically, it's hardware inside a box and software that runs on a user's uh, tablet, laptop, or smartphone and allows them to fly drones in a way that's safe, reliable, but most of all, useful for a professional to get work done. Basically, a heated and insulated pipe coupling. And for mobile applications, I built this to go um, in the back of a pickup truck between the water tank and the ball valve so that the ball valve wouldn't freeze up. Inventors from around the state and even Laura 48 came to compete. One girl who just turned 13 years old today came all the way from Florida with an idea. We're going to be doing an anti-graffiti app for our innovation. Um, well, you know when you go around and you see graffiti and stuff, usually what you have to do now is you have to like call City Hall and it takes like a really long time. You download the app, um, you take a picture or a video, and then it sends to both City Hall and the police department. The competition will finish up later this evening with an award ceremony celebration. The first place winner could receive a check for $10,000, so we asked a few inventors what they would do with the prize money. If we win, uh, we're going to keep inventing and keep uh, you know, marketing and keep pushing forward. If we could make these and make them affordable and get them to market, that would make me, that would make me very happy. Just seeing this utilized, being able to solve a problem that people have. This event is made possible by several generous sponsors. Inventors are asked to compete every other year, but in case you missed it this year, everyone is invited to submit their invention ideas for 2015. Reporting from the Arctic Innovation Competition, this is Katie Looper.